Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, Cloud Thinking. Go ahead, like, share, subscribe if you like seeing these tutorials. Show your support. So in today's video, we are going to discuss task panes. Task panes basically a, a window that helps you perform common tasks without covering your document, which you know makes it difficult to work on if you have something that's completely covering your document and you can't exactly see what you're doing. So what this actually does is allows you to use the task pane without covering the document so you can continue to edit so let's go ahead and look at a contextual tab that we recently discussed and let's insert let's insert a shape uh, we'll do this one so again format contextual tab right here and the task pane that we are going to open we're going to look at formatting a shape. So to open the task pane for the shape, we're going to right click and we'll go to format shape. And of course, your actual task pane uh, appears over here off to the side and you have your fill options for your, your fill and your line. So you can select color, transparency, your line. You can select the actual border, whether it's transparent, the width of the border. Uh, you can also do custom setups, such as if you want something to glow, you can choose the type. And of course, as you see, it adds the element around the actual object. And you can do text box within and select whether it's the middle, horizontal. You can do alt text, so you can actually give it a title and a description. And again, just tons of formatting options for shapes. You can do this pictures, actually offers uh, several other options here. And this allows you just to do quick formatting. This is a primary way that I actually format everything. And I leave this up because even though you select off of this, if you go and add another shape, it actually comes in handy because you have another shape you just go grab it and then this actually whatever shape you have highlighted is the options that it's going to give you so you can do no fill you can do pattern fill it's going to give you tons of patterns and again uh, you can select your colors and format the object a quick note about task panes is there's there's actually several depending on what you're actually going to do so if you're going to format text of course you have several options there as well and that is going to be it about task panes I hope you liked the video I know it was short but I'm breaking this down into sections because there's a lot of content that my uh, tutorial videos are going to cover and I want to make sure that we segment it accordingly so that it is an overwhelming to everyone. Again, uh, like, share, subscribe, and thank you for your support, and have a good night.